Hello everybody and welcome to another Ball Review here on the Golf Clash Tommy YouTube channel. This time for the Big Top Bundle including Big Top Ball and the Season 39 Ball. Before we do take a look at those two, make sure that you do hit that like button. Also subscribe to the channel and turn on the notifications. Make sure to get the Ultimate Tournament Guide for Pro Expert and or Master by going to patreon.com slash golfclashtommy. Link directly in the description down below. So come on, come one and all to see the marvel that is the big top ball. Power 3, top spin boost 5, side spin 1 and wind resistance 1. Condensing color and vibrance into a ball you can take anywhere. The big top ball is definitely a sight to, be, to behold. With a gorgeous myriad of colors and lights cascading all over your opponents will be awestruck. Oh my god. A great all-arounder. Uh, or a great all-rounder ball with solid stats for every scenario is topped off with top spin boost 5 so you can roll down the course to victory. <clears throat> Dominate the course and look good while doing it with the new season 39 ball. With its sleek modern design, golfers will know you're not messing around when you pull out this bad boy. Blushing red details scatter the ball atop a gorgeous deep navy base. If the design isn't enough then the powerful stats might be more your flavor. Side spin 5 and wind resistance 5 turn this ball into a true match for those difficult high wind scenarios where pinpoint accuracy is key. The carnival isn't in town for long so make sure you grab some of these while you can. We're right. A lot of text. So we're <laughs> gonna take a look at the balls and we're gonna start with the big top ball. First and foremost in my opinion this is probably the best looking ball Golf Clash has ever made. I think the design of this one is absolutely incredible. Uh, and, you know, just based on that, I'm gonna get this ball. You know, I'm a collector, so yeah. Power 3, top spin boost 5, side spin 1, wind resistance 1. For those that has a um, good eye for the different golf balls in Golf Clash, uh, knows that this is a very a close one to the spirit ball the spirit ball is one of the kind that do have wind zero power three top spin boost five right and also side spin three very rarely we use more than one side spin with all the top spin but still so this one is very very similar to that it also has a plus three overpower needle stability which makes this ball to be a nice one when it comes to sended wins in tournament so for me this is a ball that if you do play master and don't have a bunch of spirit balls this is a must have um and you know expert i'm not gonna say it's a must have because we are playing from second t but in master definitely this is a absolute must have if you don't have uh, um have the big uh, have any spirit balls and sure the wind resistance one uh, it makes the wind to be around berserker type of wind so it's not going to be as good as a spirit, but again, yeah, all balls nowadays with top spin boost is definitely going to be something to have. But the reason I do only give this one a 3 out of 10 in tournament play, even though I say it's a must have, is because it's a must have in certain scenarios. It doesn't mean that it's a must have all the time. So it's going to be very few times we're going to use it, but when we can or should use it, then it's going to be an absolute must or you will be in a massive disadvantage. Um, and then we do have tour play. I would give it 1 out of 10. Because sure, power 3, top spin boost 5 makes the ball go long. Side spin 1, wind resistance 1 are, in my opinion, especially together, is some type of a key factor when you do play in tour play. Sure, this ball could maybe be used in tour 7, tour 8, tour 9, maybe on some occasions tour 10, but it's not made for that in my opinion so i give it one out of ten i believe this ball should never be used in tour play save this one to play in tournament now the season 39 ball is more towards par threes in tournaments in my opinion you can also use this ball on par fours and also on short par fives where obviously the wind resistance five is going to help immensely when it comes to the second shot also has a plus three overpower needle stability which may which which again makes this ball great to use on par fours and par fives in tournaments also uh, to you know to actually get the power one to not be as you know bad as it 
originally is. But win 5, side spin 5 is good. This is mainly a par 3 ball as already explained, but you can use it on other occasions. I give it 6 out of 10 as I do see a lot of value. Uh, to this ball obviously if you do have a bunch of power one win five balls you know maybe not stock up but again it's a win five ball and especially players that do play in the higher divisions will uh, be using win five balls more or less every single tournament tour play i give it three out of ten and that's purely based on the power if the power would have been up two or a three that rating would have skyrocketed a little bit maybe it's a little bit too low with three out of ten but i do believe that this ball once again are designed for tournament player not for tour play but obviously you decide what you want to where you want to use it but a power one ball it's not often that we use a power one ball uh, above tour number nine you know and maybe even not in tour number nine but again though it's a good it's a nice looking ball uh, six out of ten in tournament three out of ten in tour play and i want to hear your thoughts about both of these balls so please let me know in the comment section down below how you would rate it so let's take a look at the needle spin in action as both of them has plus three the needle speed will be the same and both of them once again will be uh, great to use and look at the big top ball like look at the design it's Honestly, it's absolutely amazing. Uh, now, season 39, same thing there. It should be fairly simple to get that ball to be close to perfect or hitting perfect with max overpower. And, you know, we like that, but, you know, in the end, it's not going to be, especially in the season 39 ball, the overpower will be used less than what we do have on the big top ball where we will be using overpower a decent amount. You can get this ball in Gold Clash Shop, obviously, in, in the app. Uh, so make sure to grab one if you do uh, want to. So in the end though, uh, thank you so much for watching this ball review here for the Big Top Bundle when the Big Top Ball and the Seaton 39 Ball and a massive good luck in your Gold Clash game.